is three weeks post running my first ever half marathon and I cannot believe that I actually did that. It was such a crazy experience. Hi, I'm Steph. Welcome to my little YouTube channel where I'm documenting rediscovering wellness and productivity in my 30s without getting too overwhelmed. So back in February, I decided to run a half marathon because I saw a bunch of TikTok videos of people doing it and I thought, why not? Why not do that? Last month in June, I finally did it. I ran 21 kilometers. I literally cannot believe I did. But what I'm actually most proud of is that I was able to balance training and my social life because in the past, I would seclude myself and only focus on my personal goal. But this time around, I had to balance planning my wedding, having the actual wedding, going to travel on multiple trips and still do the half marathon to be honest though i don't think that i would have been able to do this whole thing without one working from home and two the support of my wonderful husband i was so grateful for the support that i got from my husband when it came to like prepping for meals or even walking our dogs because sometimes i was going out to run for like an hour sometimes two hours and there was no way that i was gonna go on another hour walk with our dog so i was really lucky that he was able to take on that um task for me so that one of the big realizations that I had during one of my runs during one of my long runs was that I realized how much of a privilege being able to run a half marathon or any kind of like long distance run actually is because it takes so much time and effort and money to be honest I think in a way for me like running this half marathon and training for it was kind of a celebration of where I am in life right now and the fact that I have the time and resources to dedicate to something like this because there's no way I would have been able to do that a couple of years ago. Today's video is just going to be a little vlog style video of me sharing what it was like one day before the race and during the actual race day as well. So to get started, we're going to rewind it back to three weeks ago to one day before the big day. morning it is actually the next day now we are one day away from the half marathon and i am very very anxious about it because i'm just so not prepared i barely ran this week i barely did any strength exercises the thing is that yesterday i spent the entire afternoon power washing our deck and i'm feeling some lower back pain now especially on my left hand side of my lower back and kind of like my upper glute so i really don't know how i am going to run 21k tomorrow but i wanted to show you guys what i got yesterday so i'll show you what i have in terms of fuel in order to prepare for tomorrow you will very quickly be able to tell what my favorite brand is and also kind of the only brand that i've tried so far is yesterday i went to the met and we got all of these things <laughs> yes they're all by honey stinger or honey stinger honey stinger i don't know the only two that are not are these ones by huma which i haven't tried yet i'm not gonna try them tomorrow for the first time i got some waffles that i have never tried before but i just wanted to try them and then we have the chews as well so i have like a love-hate relationship with these because i really i think they're fun because it kind of tastes like you're eating candy when you're running but it's also really hard to like chew and eat while you run so then i have to like walk i'm only gonna bring um probably like three three of these things um either like two of these gels one of the one of the chews um or like two chews and one gel but probably most likely two gels and one chew and now let me go get my amazon box okay so again everything is from honey stinger um the, i got a whole box because that's what they sell on amazon we have the uh which one is this fruit smoothie so i actually haven't tried this fruit smoothie and i really really hope i like it uh last time i tried it was um i tried the acai pomegranate one and i really like that one so i'm sure this one will taste very similar though so we have a whole box of the gels and i believe that there are 24 
24 packets in these. In terms of chews, we have these ones. You see them here. I'm not gonna open the whole box, but they're here. So that is what I have in terms of the fuel for tomorrow. Right now, we're actually gonna go to Barry to pick up my running kit or my race kit, which includes my bib, I believe, and just like picking up my number. I will bring you guys on my journey to pick up my running kit, and I'm really excited. It's a little too small for me, so I think I need to come back tomorrow and ask for a medium. But we'll see if I have time for that. All right, let's go find somewhere to go hang out and explore. enough time to sleep a little more I think but <laughs> I'm actually up because I want to make sure to drink enough coffee to um, go to the bathroom <laughs> before I actually go so I am so tired right now but I'm also really excited I just need to have some coffee and like wake up a little bit wake up a little bit and then Get ready. Thank you. 